Welcome back to my channel. This is my makeup look today. It's kind of like a really shiny bronzy color on the lids and kind of some plummy purple lips. And I really hope that you enjoy watching this video. As always, all the products that I used on my face today will be listed down in the description box below. For my face primer, I'm going in with the Too Faced Hangover Setting Spray. I'm going to just put a bit of this on my hands and then just kind of spread it all over my face. For my foundation, I want to use this Becca one. I've not used this one in quite a long time, but I'm pretty sure it's too dark for me. So I'm going to mix it with the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation in the shade 105. And I have the Becca one in the shade Driftwood. I'm putting like a half pump of each of these onto my... Um, it Cosmetics number 77 airbrush brush and then I'm gonna kind of just dot it all around also the Becca foundation is the ultimate coverage 24-hour foundation the shade match is pretty good mixing those two together it's still a little bit compared to my neck it's a smidgen off so I'm gonna take some more of the lighter foundation the Fenty one and just use it to kind of highlight parts of my face here about what you would do with concealer you know to brighten it up for my under eye concealer I'm using the LYS triple fix full coverage concealer I have the shade LG1 and I'm going to just put a bit of this underneath my eyes here about like that and then also oops, I just missed the bottle and then also blend this up onto my eyelids so I blended out my concealer and now I'm going in with some blush. This is by e.l.f. It's the Halo Glow Beauty Wand Blush. The shade is Pink Me Up. I've used this as an eyeshadow before, but I'm not used it as a blush yet. So I'm going to put just a few little dots like that and just blend this together. And then add like a little bit more to build it up, I think. Okay, blush is all blended. I'm now setting my face with the RCMA Loose Powder on just a big fluffy brush. This is by Wet n Wild. And I'm setting my whole entire face with this more on the eye area and like where the blush is, but just a light dusting over the rest of my face. I have a few products that I just bought recently that I'm going to be trying today. Also the mascara and my setting spray. It's quite warm today. I'm, um, I'm really tired if you can't tell. I probably seem really low energy right now. I seem low energy in a lot of my videos, but usually that's just because it's how I act. But today it's specifically because I'm tired. This is by Lottie London. I've never tried this before. I just bought it this morning. And it's the Stay Matte AF Setting Spray. It smells alright. Kind of cucumbery. I'm gonna see how I like that. It's supposed to be a matte finish. They also had a dewy one, but I don't really like dewy setting sprays. That um, setting spray dried. I also did my eyebrows, and I think it does kind of look matte. It looks really nice. Like, it's not like stark matte. You know, you can still see a little bit of, you know, like... For my face highlighter, I'm using um, an eyeshadow that I used in a video I did last week, and I really, really liked it as a face highlighter. It's from the Wander Beauty Sweet Escapes palette, the shade First Class. It was very pretty as a highlight. It's a very pretty highlighter. A little bit on the nose as well and the Cupid's bow, of course. So for my eyeshadow, I'm using this one by Galactic. It's like just a, a liquid eyeshadow. It's the Metallic Eye Sparkle. The shade is Glam. I don't think I've ever used this before. I probably got it in a BoxyCharm a while back. But I'm going to put a little bit of this on the back of my hand. It's kind of just a really nice bronzy shade. And then I'm going to take a fluffier brush and just kind of blend this into my crease. Like I want to stamp it on here first and then blend it back and forth. This is a really pretty, I should have been using this. This is a really pretty eyeshadow. It's got like a lot of glitter in it. I'm taking a little bit of this on the little wand that comes with and putting it on my lower lash line here and then blending that. Okay, so it's a little bit messy around the edges there because, you know, it's kind of hard to blend this because it dries so quickly. So I'm taking the shade Carry On from this Sweet Escapes palette on just a smaller, like, pencil brush. And I'm using this to blend out the edges of this because the shade, this shade is very similar to that one. It's a little bit lighter. So now what I'm going to do is put this shade on the center of it. This is by Urban Decay. This was my favorite eyeshadow years ago. I loved this. I used it all the time. It was in a palette. The shade is Midnight Cowboy Rides Again. And just press it all over my lid here. There's a bit of fallout with this one because it's a pressed one. So I'm going to sweep that up in a moment. What I'm going to do first is add some inner corner and some brow bone highlight using this, the Jumbo Eye Pencil by NYX in the shade Cottage Cheese. My favorite one for this type of highlight. This shadow looks kind of a little bit weird on camera because 
when it catches when it's not catching the light it just looks really dark so for my mascara i'm trying a new mascara this is by wet n wild it's the mega volume mascara plus i want to try this lash primer from covergirl so now i'm going to go with my mascara the mega volume mascara by wet n wild i don't know what this wand looks like either that's all right it's kind of just simple it smells like a mascara I'm outlining my lips with the Suede Matte Lip Liner by NYX. The shade is Prune. So I'm outlining and filling them in like halfway with this liner. And then over the top of this, I'm going to go in with this, with this lip balm by NYX. It's the Fat Oil Slick Click Lip Balm. And I have, I have the shade Double Tap. And I'm going to just go over the top of this with this. I really like these NYX lip balms. Like they really just blend into any like lip liner that you put underneath it. I want to get into more shades. I only have this one so far. And that was the last step and here's the finished makeup look. I'm going to show you my outfit real quick that I'm wearing today. And this is my outfit. It's just a simple little um black skirt and then this little blue like short sleeved sweater top. My little kitty cat necklace. And then just some black tights and then my regular little black pumps. Nothing crazy. It's just a casual little outfit. In my opinion. In my opinion, this is a casual outfit. I know other people would have would have vastly different opinions about that, but, but this is my channel. I really hope that you enjoyed watching this video today. And I, and I really hope that you come back to my channel for the next videos that I post. I post twice a week on Mondays and Thursdays. Subscribe to my channel and hit the little like bell notification if you want to get notified whenever I post a new update, a new video. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Also, my nails are red this week because that's my favorite color to do.